Hey everyone, so sorry about the flat hair, but I just had a bath and can't bother to do it. So product of the month again, or product of December at least. After, after my last tutorial that I just did, I had a huge amount of people ask me about the eyelash applicator that I mentioned in the tutorial that I showed you. So I'm going to review it today and it's going to be product of the month because they are amazing. <clears throat> This is what the eyelash applicator looks like, and this is by Shuamora, and you can get it here in the UK. You can also get it, well, I got this actually on eBay, so you can definitely get it. I don't know how many are in stock there, but um, just type in eyelash applicator and it will come up, but you can also go to a Shuamora shop and get this. So it looks like this, which is like a very odd looking uh, tweezer. And what happens is, and I'm going to take a uh, lash from here, and this is Lash 21 by Lamasca, for those of you that wondered what lash it was in the previous tutorial. So you can check out that tutorial if you haven't, because you'll see how to use these to apply it. I've also used them in another tutorial, so you can see it's slightly more in depth as well coming up. So you just basically get the eyelash, you obviously would apply the glue to it. You then take the, um, take the eyelash applicator, and you place it right on the end of the eyelash, like that. Okay, the glue's here. There's the eyelash applicator. And we turn it around because it's this way around. All you do then is look into a mirror, preferably a magnified one if you can, and you start on the inner corner of the eye and you literally just place it in it straight like that. And then you just push in the other side and the whole thing goes down it takes seconds to apply false eyelashes. Now, if any of you have used fake, fake eyelashes before, you know that they're a nightmare to apply. It does take practice. It does take some amount of skill to learn it. It's worth learning it because there are certain eyes, particularly hooded eyes, that absolutely can benefit from fake eyelashes because it really can open up the eye. If you have um, naturally occurring hooded eyes, Asian eyes, almond eyes, whatever you want to call it, then all I'm going to say is, Definitely fake eyelashes can look amazing, but if it's naturally occurring, like with an Asian eye, try not to get the really long strips. You're better off with sort of a third lash because when the eyelash comes too close in here at the inner corner, it can close in the eye. So third, sort of a third of a lash is much better. This, <clears throat> I mean, I've got a lot of stuff, but this applicator is one of the best things that I own truly because it allows me to put fake lashes on in an instant and get them really close to the lash line and then blend them in. And how I blend them in is with a, can you see that? Whatever, there it is. It's a mascara brush. This is by MAC. I have no idea what the number is because it's, it's worn off because I've used it that many times. So you've got your fake eyelashes on. What I do is get some mascara, put it on the wand because I tend to squeeze it out because I have, um, squeezy mascaras and then I pull the lid up slightly and I just brush up the mascara and it attaches to the fake lash and looks like your own. So there you go. That's definitely product of the month and one that I truly, truly believe in because it makes my life a lot simpler and fake eyelashes when done really nicely look amazing. So thanks for watching and I will see you all next time. Take care. Bye.